Hi guys, welcome to my new After Effects video. In this video, I am gonna show how to make this NFT project with After Effects and Element 3D. Let's get started. So first step, let's create new solid layer. Right mouse, new and solid. Add name, texture. Click OK. Then again create new solid layer for Element 3D. Right mouse new and solid, add name element 3D, click OK. Then let's hide this element layer and select this texture. Go to shape layer, select this range tool and let's make random mask ranges like this. Okay, nice. Then click selection tool and let's hide this texture layer. Let's enable element 3D and select this element solid. Go to FX, video corporate and element. Then open these custom layers and custom text and mask. Select this path layer, texture. Then go to scene setup and click extrude. Okay, and click rotate tool, select this rotate line, hold shift, change rotation. Okay, then change bevel scale to, okay, and click move tool. Let's control D for duplicate, move to right, again control D, move to right, and select this three extrusion, and let's Ctrl D, move to right. Okay, again select all these extrusions and Ctrl D, move to up and select rotate tool, change rotation like this. Okay, nice. Then click move tool and go to create, select this plane and move to here this plane change scale like this okay let's go to click this icon and enable show ambient occlusion nice then go to preset and let's select this physical and let's use this black outline for these textures and this and this Okay, nice. Then go to import and select this brand. I will show this brand download model. Click open and click OK. Let's click move tool and move to up. Move to here. Click scale tool. Let's change scale. Okay. And move to center. Okay, nice. So, let's use black old lines for this brain model. And here, here, and here. Okay, nice. Let's click environment for CHDR image. We can change this HDR here, click here and change HDR from Google and I will use here click environment folder and let's try this or this or this okay this is nice so Let's select this brain and change aux channel, change aux channel 1, click OK. So let's create new camera, right mouse, new and camera. 
click OK and we can change camera view settings here hold this icon and select these icons for shortcut you can use press C in the keyboard I will use C and let's change view OK And let's select this element and go to render settings, open ambient occlusion, click this checkbox for enable and change intensity 10. Okay, good. And let's, let's try change lighting, maybe cinematic and let's open physical environment. We can change settings, gamma and exports. Let's try. Okay, let's try this change. Okay, so let's select this element 3D again. Go to this one group and open aux channel, open channel 1 and rotation. I will change rotation with this tool. Okay, let's make rotation keyframe. frame. Press U for C keyframe frame and go to 10 keyframe. frame. Change this to let's see. Okay, very nice. I can change animation like this. Let's make new shape frame. Press you again, see shape frame. And go to one second. Let's move to down. Go to two second. Select first shape frame. Control C, Control V. Select shape frames. Let's make easy ease and control C. Go to last shape frame, control V. Again, last shape frame, control V. Let's see. Okay, very nice. Let's again control V. Okay, nice. So let's make a little bit camera animation. Select this camera for controller, right mouse, camera, and create orbit null. Then press air make year rotation and go to 10 second let's change one let's see okay this is very good and let's make x rotation go to here go to two second and change rotation like this let's see and go to four second select this shape frame control c control v let's see Okay, and select shape frames, control C and control V. Select all these X rotation shape frames and hold Alt, move to right. Let's see. Okay, very nice. So, select this null. Let's hold Shift, press P. Make new position shape frame. Go to here. And in this time, let's change like this let's see okay and go to here go to six second select first shape frame control c control v and let's move to here and move to left let's see okay and select first shape frame control c go to last shape frame control v for loop animation Okay, let's see. Nice, very good. So, let's select this camera, open settings, camera options, and let's change quality quarter. Click depot field, click on, change aperture 100, and let's change focus distance. Okay, and change aperture 200 and blur level 150. Okay, let's change quality full. Okay, very good. Okay, let's preview video. So, thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck.